Hello everyone, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. Guess what? It's Friday. Coming up on the weekend. For most of you, it's my work week. But, you know, this neither here nor there. We're not talking about me, we're talking about you. So, it's time for the weekend top and bottom of the deck reading. For those of you who are new here and don't know how we do this, I go by the elements. It's Leo season. Hey! Leo's a fire sign, so we'll start with fire and go around the wheel accordingly. Same as a sun sign reading. If it resonates, cool. If it don't, check your moon rising or Venus sign reading. Time and energy are both fluid. All things can be vice versa, and cross watchers are always welcome. So, without further ado, let's get this rolling. Universe Source and Spirit, what do we have in store for our fire sign friends this weekend? King of Pentacles reversed and the Fool reversed. might have an offer coming in that might not be what it's built up to be and you don't 100 percent trust it okay what happened to get us here temperance in the reverse star in the reverse could be some negative energy flowing between you and whoever you're connected with could be a situation that you haven't quite healed from yet. Okay. Could be a Sagittarius, an Aries, or an Aquarius you're dealing with. Five of Swords in the reverse. Three of Pentacles in the upright. Possibly had a hard time picking up the pieces. Trying to build foundations elsewhere. Maybe we'll get a clarifier on that. What's coming in for this weekend? Ah, okay. Knight of Swords reversed, Wheel of Fortune reversed. Still a lack of communication, possibly communication being totally cut off, but there's unfinished business here with this Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Something didn't close out. Okay. Let's get some clarity. Universe, Source, and Spirit, gonna get some clarity on the cards and the people from my fire sign friends, please. So sorry, the case of the dropsies today. Not literally. I'm just dropping stuff. The dropsies, the actual dropsies is something completely different. One card on the Temperance Reversed, please. Lovers Reversed. Negative energy flow. Someone not feeling the connection as deeply as the other, possibly. Okay. Why is the star reversed here? Ace of Swords upright comes out. Huh.
you never healed from it, but you probably started talking to other people. Okay. Alright. Why is the Five of Swords reversed here? Ace of Pentacles reversed. You left that connection in a shambles. You just left the pieces laying anywhere, everywhere. Put the house plant back on the back deck. So you know what? Um, I don't think this is this isn't the abundance I was looking for. Why is three pentacles up right here? Justice reversed. Trying to build foundations elsewhere because this connection was unequal. It was unfair. Unsteady. All right, why is the Knight of Swords reversed here for this weekend? Oh, two comes out. Three. Wow. Cutting off communication. Queen of Swords reversed. Nine of Cups reversed. And the shadow side in the upright. The double card, if you will. Cutting communication. Maybe have a little bit of a bad attitude toward this person. Possibly because of this lack of communication and your bad attitude, you might go off and do something a little bit half-cocked. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Yeah. I wouldn't get yourself into a connection that could potentially be toxic if I were you. You might be obsessing a little bit over it this weekend as well. Let's just not fill our cups with the wrong things, fire sign friends. Why is the Wheel of Fortune reversed here? Two came out. Magician in the reverse. Two of wands in the upright. Huh. One more. They may try to come back at you, possibly a little bit manipulative, wanting to let go of the past and move forward, but I think you're going to speak the truth. Why is the Page of Swords here? Ten of Cups reversed. You, you might just be saying how unhappy this made you. Now you don't want to go back down that road again. Ah, that makes more sense now. Some of you may just completely cut communication off, speaking truth and being like, you know what? 
You didn't make me happy. I don't trust your offer. This connection was toxic and it was a little bit obsessive and oppressive and I'm just not, I'm not feeling it. All right. Okay. Well, what's your advice? Knight of Cups reversed, Seven of Pentacles reversed. Don't wait on an empty cup. Seven of Wands reversed, Six of Pentacles in the upright. Don't give in to that little voice that says, well, maybe, and allow this to spin back out of control because you're finally regaining balance. Unless they're going to come back fair, don't give in. That's my reading for you, fire sign friends. Okay, let's move on to the earth signs. Get this sorted out real quick. Okay. Shuffle those back in. Wow, really? Did you see that? Did you see the choppy, terrible shuffle? Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What do we have in store for you this weekend? My hands just want to shuffle what I do. <sighs> Judgment reversed. Princess of Cups. Somebody might be trying to come back with a cup this weekend. What happened? Prince of Pentacles, Nine of Cups. The offer was slow moving, but solid. You were happy. You were emotionally filled. Okay. What happened after that? Lovers reversed and the Prince of Wands. Somebody wasn't feeling as much as the other person. Somebody was a little bit noncommittal. Kind of in and out of the relationship. That happens too. It happens. It's coming in for this weekend. The Six of Swords and the Nine of Wands. Earth signs, I don't think you're taking the cup. Um, I think you're going to move on from this. And your walls are going to go up. I don't even think I need to clarify this, to be honest with you. I don't. I don't need to clarify it at all. That was pretty cut and dry. Sorry for the short message, but if I don't have to clarify it, I don't. So we're just going to get your advice.
The tower reversed, ace of wands reversed. Well, don't be so quick to rebuild this tower. You're you're slated to do exactly what you're supposed to be doing at this point. Moving forward and keeping your walls up. One more. The moon reverse and the four of pentacles in the upright. Until truths of the matter come out and things are illuminated a little bit better, just kind of hang on to your heart chakra. Don't, don't, don't be so quick to let it go again. That's what I have for you, Earth Signs. Again, sorry for the short message. If it's right there, it's right there. If I don't have to clarify, I don't have to clarify. Okay, good deal. That was short, sweet, and to the point. Air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What does the universe have in store for you this weekend? Hey, sometimes a message takes 10 or 15 minutes. Sometimes it takes two or three. I don't know. I just work here, okay? I just read cards. Four of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles reversed. Holding on to something a little bit too tight, maybe. Some needy codependent energy, perhaps. Oi, okay, what happened? Page of Pentacles reversed, Star reversed, someone stagnant. Negative energy flow between you. Something didn't heal. Something came to a dead stop. Left you wounded. Next. The sun in the upright. Judgment in the upright. You found happiness again. You made the judgment call to close the cycle out. Move forward to the next chapter. You allowed something to die. For something else to resurrect. Okay. Okay. So what's going on this weekend? Ace of Cups reversed. Seven of Swords reversed. You're vulnerable. You... I think you're laying low in the love department this weekend. You're not taking cups. You're not giving cups. You're just kind of... You know what? Uh, I'm not ready. Okay. You're still trying to get a handle on it. You're still holding on to something. Let's get a little bit of clarity on this down here. Specifically, that seven of wands reversed. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity for my air sign friends, please? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. A little bit of clarity for my air sign friends. Two of Wands. Letting go of the past, moving forward on the path. Mm -hmm. 
Seven of Cups reversed, Queen of Cups, you're choosing you. You're not making decisions right now. You're not giving cups. You're not taking cups. You're still trying to weave your way through your emotions and you're loving yourself first. I like it. I like it. Let's get some advice. Four of Swords in the upright, Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Lay it to rest and accept that this wasn't going to have the happy ending you want. It wasn't going to be abundant. It wasn't going to be the big brick house with the white picket fence and the 2.5 kids and the dog and the pool and all that happy jazz. Lay it to rest. It was not meant to be. It was not meant to completion. Okay. Six of Pentacles reversed. The Ten of Pentacles reversed comes back out again. Until you level off and regain your balance, don't try to build the dream. If you're not ready, you're not ready. If you gotta let something go, you gotta let something go. Don't chase. I like it. Okay. Well, that's an honest message. Thank you, universe. Thank you, source and spirits. Air sign friends, let me know if it resonates. Okay. What about my water sign friends? What's going on for Cancer Pisces Scorpio this weekend? Huh? What's going on with you guys? Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Cancer, your season just ended. And I'll be honest. Cancer season was a little much for me, so just a very emotional time, but that's okay. It's Leo season. I'm getting my fire back. Okay. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. What's going on with you guys this weekend? Queen of Swords reversed, Ace of Swords in the upright. Oh, you throwing shade at something. You got a little bit of an attitude about something or somebody, and you're just ready for the next big thing. You know what? Um, I'm moving on. Next. You're talking to new people. New communication. New thought processes. I like it. What happened? Seven of Pentacles, King of Cups. Patiently waiting for something to fruit because you had deep feelings for it. Okay, what happened after that? Queen of Cups, Six of Wands. Oh, I'm going to have to clarify this. By the looks of things, the feelings may have been mutual. Find out why that Six of Wands is here in a minute. It's returning after a battle. Hmm, okay. What's going on this weekend? Magician, the Ace of Pentacles, calling it in. Manifesting something new and abundant. Might be a little bit slow moving, but... Hmm. 
Huh. Okay. Now I'm totally confused, water signs. I've got a bad attitude about something. Why, why the bad attitude? Universe Source and Spirit, can I get some clarity from my water sign friends, please? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? One card. Strength reversed, King of Swords reversed. I'll take two. You waited for something. It became slightly draining. Probably made a decision regarding the matter based on emotion. Why is the King of Cups here? Empress. You had deep feelings for this. You wanted this. You wanted it to grow. Okay. Perhaps some of you have deep feelings with someone you already have children with. Okay. And that's where the emotion-based decision came in. Okay. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Lovers reversed. There was strong feelings, but someone just didn't feel it. Didn't, didn't feel it as strongly. One more. Nine of Swords, Death. Someone maybe became a little bit obsessive. Could have been you, could have been then. There was sleepless nights. Spiritual change. Why is death here? I got Leo, Taurus, Gemini, Scorpio... Aries on the board so far. A little bit of everybody, really. Eight of Pentacles reversed, Three of Swords reversed. Someone couldn't put the work into the connection. Someone was trying to come out of a state of heartbreak. Okay. Oh, okay. Why is the Six of Wands here? That's why it disconnected. Six of Wands, Six of Swords. Someone possibly decided to return to something and the other person moved on. One more. Thanks. 
Queen of Pentacles upright, shadow side reversed. Yep. There was a return. I don't know who went back to what and who moved on, but somebody decided that they were better off on their own and better off disconnecting from the obsessive energy. Okay. Okay. Well, what's happening this weekend? Why is the magician here? Maybe someone had a bad attitude toward you and decided to start talking to other people. Okay. Fine, I'm gonna take my swords and move on then. And my pinnacle. You know, take it however it resonates, guys. Why is the magician here? Emperor reversed. Manifesting new things, but still a little bit vulnerable. Swords reversed. Ace of Wands upright. Still vulnerable, but making that difficult decision to manifest new things and strike new matches in new places. Okay. Why is Ace of Pentacles here? Two of Wands reverse pops out. Has the potential to be abundant. Might be a little bit slow moving because somebody's still stuck at crossroads. King of Cups reversed, Knight of Wands reversed. Slow moving because you're still stuck at the crossroads or they are, whoever you're connecting with. They want a commitment. They want something real. They don't want to just hand that cup to anybody. So it's going to be a little bit closed off at first, but it has potential. Let's get your advice. Five of swords and judgment. It is time to pick up the pieces and close the chapter and start the next. The moon reversed, temperance reversed. Don't lose patience. This is a matter of divine timing. Things are still yet to be illuminated in the situations. Take your time water sign friends okay all right everybody have a good weekend thanks for stopping by hopefully my monday or my um saturday and sunday aren't too awful so i can get the work week top and bottom up sunday night when i get home from work we'll see how things go <laughs> um i'm gonna try not to skip it next week again you know i can't I only have so much control over the energies that get thrown at me. And you can only protect yourself so much in the industry I work in. So we'll see what happens. But take care. I love you guys. Two bits. See you Monday.